Hello everyone. Welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to explain the working of regenerative cylinder with animation. And this regenerative means the extending speed is to be increased. If the extending speed is to be increased, the rate of flow should be more for the extending stroke. And that how we are going to provide in this regenerative cylinder, we are going to take in with the animation in this session. This is the arrangement of the regenerative cylinder circuit. Here it consists of a tank, pump, direction control hall, pressure relief hall and double acting cylinder. In this regenerative cylinder, one of the port of the four-way direction control hall is blocked. When the direction control hall is in its left envelope, the fluid flowing from the pump flows to the, this direction control hall where one port is blocked. Therefore, there is no flow through the direction control hall. The fluid is bypassing direction control hall and entering to the rod end side of the cylinder. And the fluid from the piston end of the cylinder port that will be flowing through the direction control hall to the tank. And during the rat retraction, the working of this regenerative cylinder is same as that of the double acting, normal double acting cylinder. When the direction control valve switches to its right envelope, then the fluid from the pump is flowing through the direction control valve to the piston end of the cylinder. Then the fluid from the rod end of the cylinder, which will bypassing the direction control valve and regenerates the pump flow. That means the addition of this to the uh, flow from the outlet of the rod and side will be to the pump flow taking place. And if the regenerative flow QR is added to the Q pump, then the total flow rate will be more. The rate of flow entering during the extension stroke will be more. And that's why the extending speed will be increases. And that is called as a, the addition of this uh, outlet flow of the, this rod and side fluid to the pump flow during the extension stroke. That is called as a regeneration. And this how the regeneration for the particular application when the extension speed required is more than the retraction speed, we are going to use this regenerative cylinder circuit. Thanks for watching. If you like, share, subscribe and comment.